Welcome back, Taurus. Hope you guys are doing well. We're just gonna get started. All right, we just gonna get started. We ain't got we ain't got time. We got we gonna make dinner. All right, we ain't, we ain't got time. We we gonna get started. All right. So, Taurus, this is the energy that around is around you. Or what's coming towards you? Let us see what we have for Taurus. Okay. Oh, we're getting a little bit stubborn, Taurus. <laughs> That's you guys. All right, so this is for Taurus. This is for Taurus. This is for Taurus. Taurus, this is for you guys. Okay, your energy. Earth, Earth energy here. Okay. Okay, there you guys are with the Empress. Beautiful. We have two kings here, though. <laughs> Some of you guys could be dealing with an Aries Leo Sagittarius or a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Um, or another Taurus like yourself. Taurus Libra. Okay. So let us see what's going on here. Some of you guys, there could be a pregnancy. Okay. So if you're, if you're trying to conceive, then <laughs> spread them. <laughs> spread them. Don't need to ask or beg him, because it's, it's here. <laughs> All right, let me stop. Let me stop. Okay, so this is for Taurus. Taurus, this is for you. Oops, too many. Let's try that again. Some of you guys, there's like some type of slow moving energy here. Somebody can be slowly moving towards you. I'm probably taking forever. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Well, the person's gonna, they're, they're gonna pick up their feet. They're gonna pick up their feet. Maybe I should put it this way. Okay. All right, let's see what's going on. For Taurus. Or, ooh, try that again. Taurus. Oh, there you are again, Taurus. Okay. Okay. So, if you guys are dealing with an emperor, I'm getting this emperor energy here. Some of you guys, somebody could be keeping um, their feelings or emotions or something to themselves, a secret or to themselves. Okay. So it looks like somebody could have been dragging their feet here. Um, I feel like this person's, I think something's going to change here. Um, if you've been waiting for commitment, we're still going to clarify these. I feel like that could be coming. There is some type of cycle completion here. Um, let's see. Okay, so some of you guys could have had drama with this person. Okay, but with that temperance energy, I feel like some of you guys, there's an energy of wanting things to be balanced. Maybe some of you guys weren't seeing eye to eye with this person. Okay, maybe you guys weren't seeing eye to eye. Maybe there was a lot of drama, confusion, um, competition and stuff like that, okay? But I do see that there is something changing here, okay? Let me get one more for that. Okay, look at that. Okay, Ten of Cups. That looks good. That looks good. So some of you guys could have a family with this person or there's something about emotional um fulfillment that that is here with this person some of you guys are healing from this person um or took a break from this person and maybe things were moving slow i feel like that is going to pick up where there was drama i feel like there is there is an there's an energy of balance that's coming in something that's that's trying to balance out this energy okay we have too many here All right. Some of you guys, if you've been, some of you guys, some of you guys, your single days are going to be done. 
Some of you guys, your single days are done. Because we have this, look at that. <laughs> we have this King of Pentacles that's flying out too. We have this Nine of Pentacles with the world card. The world is a, the world card, um, most readers will, will say that this is, it's a completion of a cycle. And clarifying that is the Nine of Pentacles. But after the Nine of Pentacles is the Hierophant, okay? So we have, for some of you, okay, an energy of if you are single, you ain't gonna be single much longer. The overall energy of this reading is the King of Cups. Somebody with strong emotions here, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Look, lovers here at the bottom of the deck. Uh -huh. Okay, so some of you guys are dealing with another earth sign or this person could be very focused on money, um, a, a business person or something like that. There is something that is, is changing or completing, okay? Some of you guys, maybe there was an unrequited love situation with this person. Here we have the emperor here. This person could have been a player. This person could have been um, non-committal. They could have been in and out. I feel like this person's coming right towards you. So if you guys are dealing with uh, another uh, Taurus or a fire sign. Some of you guys, there's some type of communication coming from this person. Okay. I'm going to sneeze. Mm. So some type of truth and clarity, some type of clarity coming in. Um, bless me. Yeah, I feel like there's an energy... Of moving towards calmer times somebody making some type of decision maybe somebody's having an, an awakening or 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 uh, like an epiphany or something like that and maybe it has something to do with commitment maybe this person was actually non-committal yeah knight of cups in reverse ace of wands they were just giving these that, that, that big dick energy or tight clip or you know whichever whichever all right, they were just giving you, they were just giving it, put it on you. Mm -hmm. Or you put it on them, whichever. <laughs> but I feel like something is changing though. Seriously, I do see something changing. I feel like this King of Wands is taking action towards something because we have the slow energy, like somebody's dragging their feet right here. And then we have this King of Wands, the King of Action, okay? But not only that, we also have the King of Pentacles here. We have three kings out so far, which is why I think that you guys are dealing with an emperor. Um, you do have the Empress here, so I feel like some of you guys are dealing with a soulmate or a divine counterpart. Um, it looks like somebody's manifesting something. It looks like somebody's manifesting some type of communication or something like that. Um, or somebody's trying to make something happen. Let's see. Yeah. So there is something coming coming in. It's this person. There's that magician again. Somebody's trying to make something happen. I feel like somebody could have rejected something in the past. Okay. Somebody could have rejected something in the past. Maybe they, maybe some of you guys offered a cup of love and it wasn't, it wasn't accepted. Okay. There is some type of truth and clarity. I feel like somebody does want to heal something. Okay. It kind of came out sideways, but I do feel, and that's why I got another card here. But I do feel like somebody wants to speak their truth. There's something about clarity. There's something about hope. I feel like somebody's hoping for something here. Maybe they're hoping for you because, you know, um, they're, oh look, the completion of a cycle with that moon card. I feel like if somebody was keeping something to themselves, which I feel like it could have been their emotions, I feel like that is, that's, that's done. Because I feel like somebody's um, sitting over here with some type of regret, okay? Um, hmm. Some of you guys, somebody could have been holding on to something or holding back and I feel like that energy is changing. Something could have been very painful. Some, somebody could have felt betrayed or backstabbed or something like that. Very super guarded energy too. Or an energy of not giving up. This person's definitely coming in. They can, I feel like this person has earth in their chart. <laughs> Some of you guys are going to be starting a new cycle with this person. Okay? Some of you guys are starting a new cycle with this person. They are coming in. <clears throat> looks like it's, It looks like it could have been slow. But or it is slow, but they are coming in. There is mutual love here. Okay, there is mutual love.
And that King of Pentacles is the Sun. Some of you guys can be dealing with the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or a Leo. Okay. Happiest card in the deck with that Sun there. Let's clarify it. Something probably wasn't balanced. Something could be getting brought to the light. Something wasn't balanced here. This person could also be spying on you. So somebody could be liberating themselves. Maybe somebody was a part of another connection or something like that. Um, somebody could be liberating themselves from that. Some of you guys, this person is taking a leap of faith towards this connection. Let me get one more. Yeah, somebody could have had a decision to make between more than one person. Maybe somebody thought that the grass was greener. <laughs> somebody could have been in some type of toxic situation. I feel like they could have invested a lot of time with this person, a lot of energy. It could be a baby mother, okay? But I feel like some I feel like that's getting released, to be honest with you. I feel like that's getting released. So you guys could be getting some type of communication soon. Maybe some of you guys find out that somebody has released somebody. That's for some of you. You guys do have this energy here of it looks like it looks like an apology. Some of you guys, there could be an apology coming towards you. Some of you guys, it's a pregnancy, like I was saying before. Some of you guys, um, this person sees you as, you know, as as everything. This person sees you as breakfast, lunch, and dinner, snacks in between. They see you as a four course meal okay they see you as you know the star to their bucks okay they see you as everything this person could be coming towards you with a lot of emotions or with emotions <laughs> i feel like there's an energy of cooperation some of you guys could work with this person this person could be rushing in um, some of you guys, there's more than one person that you're dealing with. For others of you, this person could be rushing in. I feel like they might, their words might come off a little bit harsh or very cold, but I feel like the energy behind it, there is love, okay? Oh, whoa. Let's try that again. Some of you guys, somebody's standing, standing their ground for what it is that they want. They want a connection. This person is just watching you. They're spying. There's something that's... I don't know. What is this? Somebody could be avoiding this connection. But at the same time, they're watching you. See, so you have the Empress. <laughs> Some of you guys, this person... You guys are getting a lot of attention. I don't know why this person is... is with this seven of swords energy but i feel like they're definitely watching spying maybe they're just avoiding you or something like that with that seven of swords uh mm -mm. there is communication but it looks like it's delayed it looks like delayed communication i'm sorry it's coming but i don't know like this person I, like i said from before they are dragging their feet i like i mean i feel like it's done i don't know mm -mm. Okay, well, Hangman is in reverse. Some of you guys, there's an energy of releasing something. Maybe you release this person. Or maybe this person needs to release something. Take it how it resonates. This person could be self-sabotaging. Okay, we have too many here. Somebody could also have regret. Yeah, this person's an emperor. Oh, look at that. The emperor right here. Um... This person is, is trying to make some type of decision. They might need to release something, but there's a delayed communication. They're very attracted to you. Some of you guys can be busy yourselves. Some of you guys are, are keeping yourselves bit busy and you're delaying um, this communication. Some of you guys, there's an energy of just focusing on the self. There's an, en there's an energy of self-love that's here. The outcome is a new beginning. There is something new coming towards you. Okay, there is. Oh, I wasn't ready for this. The advice, let's see. So outcome is, is a new beginning. What's the obstacle? The obstacle is the empress. 
it's you you guys are the obstacle or baby mother or mother or mother figure try find that empress let's see the magician and the queen of swords somebody could be manipulative somebody some maybe this person is dealing with um uh i mean it could be you but maybe this person is dealing with another person like what we saw here and maybe this person is an air sign Maybe this person's a Gemini, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, or another Taurus or Libra or something like that. Maybe somebody's manipulative too. Why is this the obstacle? Let me see. There's something hidden. There's something hidden. Maybe somebody has a fear of somebody. Maybe somebody it feels like they're going to be ju judged harshly too or something. Or I'm not too sure. There's something hidden. Maybe somebody has options or there's a lot of confusion. <clears throat> Somebody's throat chakra could be blocked too. Um, and the advice, let's see. The advice is that there is going to be a reconciliation. Some of you guys need to go out with, with friends. You know, you need to go out, enjoy yourself. We have the, this deck came with two three of cups for some reason and you guys got both of them with the nine of cups and this is for the advice i feel like you guys some of you guys might you know be drinking just you know be just drink responsibly but some of you guys um there is a reconciliation that is going to make you happy here and for that ace of pentacles i just want to make sure you know make sure that we're all good and clear you have the page of cups so the, some of you guys there could be an, an apology or something like that but i mean it is lighthearted. there is emotions behind it okay um yeah this person is withdrawn they are in their head super in their head eight of swords i'm um, nine of swords eight of swords mm -mm 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 -mm. eventually they are going to message you okay they are all right <laughs> let let a little that little bit of that pressure build up and they will they will reach out if that's what, what you want okay taurus all right Let's get you guys some oracles for Taurus. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm. This card was trying to come out in reverse. All right, you guys have the Phoenix. New phase, rekindle, renew, transformation, growth, changed mind. Hopefully somebody is, is growing out of this, okay? Because they're over here dragging their feet like some little B-I-T-C-H. Um, stabbed in the back heartbreak pain separation deception shocking attack okay i feel bad for saying they're a little bitch but i mean i don't know they're dealing with something that obviously clearly needs to be released okay i'm just saying we have that devil there why is the devil there release what needs to be released taurus if that's you okay if it's them we can't force them to release you i mean the overall energy is about this masculine okay someone needs to release something though mm -hmm. stabbed in the back yeah somebody somebody did some fucked up shit we do have the ten of swords something painful over here then we have not enough, but it came out sideways. Frustrated in relationship, lack of confidence, self-sabotage, fear, ego issues, jealousy. Maybe this person has ego issues. Maybe this person is does have fear. What are they afraid of? Maybe they're afraid of, of loving. Maybe they're afraid of relationships. Maybe maybe their 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 baby mom was freaking some crazy ass serial killer. All right. Or you know, the if they weren't a serial killer, that maybe they were a penis killer or something. You know what I mean? Like maybe they are just traumatized from something in the past that they need to heal. And that's not like that's something that that they need to work on. You know. The golden mirror is here. Self-absorbed narcissist, one-sided relationship, love bombing. Yeah, I kind of seen that unrequited love situation in the beginning. So um, maybe somebody's too into themselves. Maybe somebody's too freaking damn selfish. So you guys, I mean, at the end of the day, something, something's something new is here and that's why this phoenix is here too because something is going to change some of you guys were dealing with uh, a runner but look meeting and conversing is right after that so i feel like you guys are going to speak with this person have some type of conversation eventually when they get out of their head i mean uh, there's like a lot of back and forth like it's like they're going to communicate but then we have you know what i mean like it's so like uh, uh. and i think this person's trying to figure out what the fuck they're they're trying to do that's why we have the seven of cups and maybe this person's confused all right, this went on a little bit longer than I intended. So I'm going to leave it here. Thank you so much, Taurus. And I'll see you guys next time. Okay, bye.